What's up guys, today I'm going to be teaching you guys how you can create some sick opium effects for your music videos. Let's go! What's up guys, my name is Devin Wynn, welcome to 11% Tutorials. As I mentioned, today I'm going to be teaching you guys how you can create some sick black and white opium looking effects for your music videos. Shout out to my friend Tiny Tapes for dropping his new opium preset pack. It's absolutely insane. This is the preset pack that we're going to be using in today's video. Doing YouTube so far has really been fun, but sometimes it feels like a great chaos. And I really feel like I'd be fighting my demons sometimes. I'm sorry guys, I'm sorry, I had to pull that one. But seriously, I do want to shout out to my friend, Tiny Tapes. This man has been absolutely killing it with his preset packs and he just dropped this sick OBM preset pack as I mentioned before and it's absolutely insane. You guys have to check it out. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into the tutorial. All right guys, so now that we're inside of Premiere Pro, right here I have some loaded up clips right here of some footage. Right here, you already know, we got that OG Ken Carson footage. Y'all don't know this, y'all don't know this. I used to edit those old internet money vlogs right here. This is that unreleased Ken Carson footage straight from the studio. Y'all have never seen this footage before of Ken Carson. Now straight to the tutorial guys, the first method right here that we're gonna be showing you how to create some opium effects, shout out to my boy, Tiny Tapes. Go check out his website at tinytapes.ca. He just dropped his new opium preset pack. It's absolutely insane right here. It retails for $39.99 and has a bunch of sick opium presets that you can literally just import into Premiere Pro and then drag onto your clips. They're absolutely insane. So today I'm gonna be showing you how you can use some of those presets and then I'm also gonna be showing you how you can create some of your own opium effects from scratch so the first thing we're gonna do is once you have his pack you're just gonna come over here hit the three hamburger icon right here in the top corner of your effects panel and just simply hit import presets and then you're gonna go ahead and select his preset the opium preset pack and boom it should be inside of Premiere Pro if you go to your presets panel right here follow you can see right here opium looks by tiny tapes shout out my boy tiny tapes absolutely insane video editor Audio off the bat you can see there's a bunch of different looks right here and it's super easy literally watch you're gonna watch watch look at me i dragged it and boom there you go we have some opium effects applied already now this first one that i use is black and white grain now this one is a combination of some noise and threshold and basically if your footage is kind of messed up at first or if it's too bright or too dark you can just basically go ahead and adjust the threshold level right here depending on how your footage looks and already at the bat you can see we have some sick like harsh looking black and white opium looks that's a really dope sick one i love this one i love this threshold grain it's super dope i'm gonna go ahead and hit command z and let's go ahead and try out the black and white crt effect this one is also crazy we have some crazy looking crt right here and once again if your threshold is different just go ahead and adjust your threshold until it fits your video and now this one right here not only do we have some nice threshold but we also have some little screen distortion and also some pixels because it's like a crt looking effect this one's also dope once again hit command z and one of my other favorite looks right here in the preset pack is this night vision one right here this one is absolutely insane i think this is probably the best one out of the entire pack in terms of like the way it looks it's just a really good looking night vision effect so far out of all the other night vision presets i've seen out there so shout out to tiny tapes he really killed it on this one and now this pack is also dope because not only does it come with a bunch of presets that you can drag and drop and apply but it also comes with a bunch of overlays that you can apply to your footage as well so right here you can see we have some nice sick crt overlay and then we also have a nice camcorder overlay right here so if you'd like to spice things up even more this crazy crt overlay is, is absolutely insane you can just drag it onto your project and you can see it's a 4k file so i actually have to scale it down because i'm using 1080p project file sequence settings and then what you do is you can just change the blending mode to screen and voila now we have some sick overlays going on to our video as well i wouldn't have this like flashing lines play over the entire video because it's kind of a lot but i would spice it up and just kind of use it for some transitions right here maybe if we want to switch to a different scene and we want some like just some interesting visuals in between we can go ahead and apply it like that and voila we have a nice little transition right there and i would also say you can go ahead and add some shakes to that some camera shakes some artificial camera shakes which just definitely spice up the whole look of this thing so overall guys i definitely recommend you checking out tinytapes.ca CA. He's got an absolutely insane store with a bunch of crazy preset packs that you definitely got to check out. But now let's go ahead and create some of these opium effects on our own. So now that you're inside of Premiere, go to your effects panel and we're going to start with our first effect, which is always going to be grain. Or you can search noise. Yeah, noise. It's called noise, but I always just search grain under noise and grain. And now the first thing we're going to do is you're going to apply this to your footage, your clip. And we are going to increase that noise amount to something about like 29 to 30 and make sure you click off color noise. I just don't like the color noise look. It's pretty ass. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back to my effects and presets and I'm going to search for the thresh 
hold effect. So I'm gonna grab this threshold effect and also apply this to our video. And now you can see everything is just dark. It, every, like, it just looked like it ruined our footage. But don't worry, come over here to the level panel control setting right here and we're just going to just adjust it and crank it until you get a nice value. This right here is a pretty good looking uh, threshold look. And once you play this out, voila, we have some sick opium looking black and white grain threshold. Absolutely dope, just like the tiny tapes pack. Now, if you wanna take this effect to even the next level and turn it into like a CRT looking effect, what you're gonna do is you can go over here and you can search for the grid effect right here, boom, the grid effect. And I'm going to apply this to our footage. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to basically decrease the border amount to two and then I'm just going to decrease the corners until we have some nice CRT cube. So like the grid is a nice like cube format. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the blending mode from none to overlay. And voila, there you go. You can see if you look really closely, we have some nice CRT lines right there and it's going to be better in the export. And also remember there's a bunch of other crazy blending modes that you can use. Stencil Alpha is also another cool one that you can use right here. This one creates a nice interesting look. I would say you could go ahead and increase the border to something like six so you can get a cool looking effect if you use stencil alpha but that basically just inverts the CRT cubes so yeah that's also another cool way that you can just spice up the the opium style looks and seriously guys as I always recommend never copy this tutorial down to the nitty-gritty details just go ahead and add you know mess around with things make the effect your own make it unique and just go ahead and play around with those settings and you'll get some dope looks now that's obviously how you can create in Premiere Pro by hand from scratch but like I said the tiny tapes pack comes with a bunch of crazy presets and the best thing is is that they're already pre-made for you they're presets and it just basically saves you all that time from having to go individually change all the settings apply it again to each clip you know just all the tedious work when you just have a preset pack that you can just drag and drop now one last key tip that i do want to add i just do want to know on we also just dropped our new crt pack at 11%.net the crt pack is absolutely insane i'm sorry i i really gotta say we poured our heart and soul out into this overlay pack this overlay pack comes with over 30 plus 4k high res files of crt footage overlays and it comes with typefaces fonts graphics icons just everything that you can possibly imagine for a crt pack right here so i just want to go ahead and show you guys some of the crt effects that we've been creating right here we have some grain but i'm going to show you this glitch too this glitch too is also pretty cool so i'm going to go ahead and scale this down of course because it's in 4k and i'm going to change Change this blending mode to screen and boom voila there you go now you see we have some nice crt effects overlaid onto our footage one of my favorite things about this pack and which i think works perfectly with the opium pack from tiny tapes is our crt overlay of our camcorder so right here this is a camcorder screen right here and i'm just going to change this blending mode to screen and boom voila you can see we have some nice crt like camcorder style looking effects overlaid onto our footage and now if you go over here to my presets and i'm just going to go ahead and apply one of the tiny tapes opium looks let's go ahead and go with this crt black and white and then i'm just basically going to mess around with this threshold level until we get a cool look something around here looks pretty good and you can see if we play this out we have an absolutely crazy looking opium look like seriously guys you can't tell me that anything doesn't look more opium than this right here absolutely great combo if you get the crt pack and the tiny tapes opium pack just absolutely insane the, the amount of creative things that you can do with this and just make a bunch of crazy opium effects is absolutely limitless. But once again, guys, though, seriously, mess around with this. Don't copy this tutorial to the exact details. Mess around with these effects, mess around with these settings, and create some of your own unique opium looks. And without further ado, here are the final results. If you guys made it to the end of the video and you managed to find any value or help from this video, really guys, if you could smash the like button and hit subscribe, it's free. All this content is free, so really it'd mean the world to me. And once again, if you're interested in copying this preset pack, make sure to check out the link in the description. Shout out to my boy, Tiny Tapes, absolutely crazy pack. I mean, you guys saw the results, so definitely make sure to check out his store. And he also has a bunch of crazy other preset packs there as well. Speaking of preset packs, if you guys are also interested in checking out our store at 11percent.net, you can definitely make sure to check out the other link in the description. We are also dropping a bunch of crazy the other preset packs we have preset packs ranging from title card presets all the way to 3d chrome overlay presets so really if you would like to take your visual effects game to the next level and also save time while you're doing it definitely make sure to check out 11percent.net really guys that's how you guys support me and keep me going so i can keep making free tutorials like this for you on youtube but once again thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video peace